Sony Pictures is not fooling around with their brand new Spider-Man universe. I'm John Campia and this is Collider Video. We've known for some time now that Sony Pictures was going to revamp their Spider-Man universe, maybe even without Spider-Man, by starting off with a Venom film. However, what I think a lot of people didn't know is how serious they really were. Well, we all know now. It was announced today that Sony Pictures has cast Tom Hardy as Eddie Brock, AKA Venom, and brought on Zombieland director Ruben Fleischer. This casting has caught a lot of people's attention for several different reasons. Number one, Tom Hardy is absolutely one of the highest rated a-list talents in Hollywood right now. But also because Tom Hardy is notorious for being extremely picky about which scripts and projects he'll get involved with. Clearly, as some people are already speculating, if Tom Hardy has signed on to be Venom, the concept Sony has for Venom must be something really special. Now we've also known for some time that Sony was looking at 2018 as a possible release date for the new Venom movie, but a lot of us thought that might be a little bit too ambitious. Well, they also announced today that October 2018, about a year and a half from now, is indeed when they're aiming to release the new film. So it's not gonna be long before we see Tom Hardy as Venom and see what this new Sony Spider-Less verse is gonna look like. What do you guys think about this move? Has the casting of Tom Hardy changed or affected your opinion about this brand new Spider-Man universe that Sony's putting together, leave your thoughts in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, keeping you up to date on everything going on in the world of movie news. As soon as more information comes along, we'll pass it on your way. I'm John Campia, and this is Collider Video.